It's like a biscuit covered in chocolate. Now you gotta take the wings and the legs off. Biggest, James. Dad, he's gone in your hand. Yeah. 100 grand. Lost one as well. What's the James? They are creating minced mapani worms, which we are now going to um, mix with a little bit of egg to make it stick together. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. It's done with a little bit of wine and a little bit of garlic. Great, huh? There's a special way of doing mapani worm. Watch, watch okay. It's been removed. And then these ones are now ready for eating. They don't take long. It's just a quick little saute and butter. I've got a friend who's a diarrhea. Yes. And they like think this is just the, the best. They often sort of get together and have fried turmeric. So you get them as soon as there's been a lot of rain. Okay. Where must we stand? Uh, okay. Over there. Okay, Jane. Smart eye. Sorry. Okay. Try and get a try and get a proper. Uh, Thanks. I enjoyed the mopani was a bit of too much of a crunch, but you know, just tell me when you're ready. Crunchy. Very good. No, they're very nice. <laughs> <laughs> the burger I had at the restaurant was better than this. But it's better than hospital food. Let's have a little bite. It's nice and soft. Do you guys want to try some chocolate? Chocolate, termites, or locusts, whatever you get. There you go. It's to give people an appreciation for insects and the role that they play. And instead of just reading about it in a book, the kids and adults can come here, they can taste them, they can feel them, they can touch them, they can smell them, and it really gives them an appreciation and an understanding of the role that they play in the world. It just tickles a living day, I thought it would. <laughs> Especially when you go to a... Uh, without just picking my nose, it's a hind leg. Get off. With scorpion on your head.